Every October for more than 125 years, Baltimore's Columbus Day Parade winds through the Inner Harbor and Little Italy. It's said to be the oldest celebration of Columbus in the nation. Observed on the second Monday in October as a legal holiday. But a new bill introduced to the City Council Monday would rename Columbus Day as an official holiday in Baltimore City to Indigenous Peoples Day. Bill sponsor, Councilman John Bullock, says his proposed change is about celebrating what he calls the true legacy of the continent. Many historians have scrutinized Columbus's achievements and treatment of Native Americans. The new world, as described by Europeans at the time, was only new to them and was not a discovery. The Native people who have been on this continent for generations are evidence of this unmistakable truth. They have not only survived, but persevered in the face of land theft, broken treaties, genocide, and discrimination. I'd rather have it be Indigenous Day instead of Columbus because, you know, Columbus never did anything for us. I don't know that that really needs to be changed or not. Um, I probably wouldn't oppose it either way, but it just seems like we're trying to eradicate history. It's stupid. It's been like this for, I'm seven, I'll be 76. We've had Columbus Day. We've had every President's Day back in the day, so uh, it's stupid. Leave everything the way it was. Baltimore has three monuments honoring Columbus. Protesters tossed one into the Inner Harbor in July, and council members are considering renaming another to honor victims of police violence. Assigned to the Housing and Urban Affairs Committee. The council voted down a Columbus Day name change proposal four years ago. This new bill now heads to committee. Well, the Italian American Civic Club of Maryland issued a statement about the proposal tonight, calling it a sad day for Baltimore and the state, and in particular for Italian Americans, saying in part, why in a time of crisis with the pandemic and obvious violent crime in the city, how can the name of a holiday even be on the agenda? Our elected officials need to fight the battles that are real. Reporting live at City Hall tonight, Kyrie, WBAL, TV 11 News.